Lagos City, Nigeria. God bless you. Wherever you see me, wherever you get to me from this is in town on Unilag TV. And we are here to support a friend, a colleague, an honor personality. He goes by the name Lamu Laskata. And when Lamu is on stage, he will always deliver. And guess what, people? It is Lamu and friends. Guess who we'll be having here? We'll be having Wally Arole. And the Amsterdam stand up comedians will be here. Harry Song will be here. In case you all do not know, Helen Paul just came in. But right about now, we're giving you people, celebrities, ask questions on the red carpet. People, you know how we do it now. Don't go anywhere, people. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. We'll right all right, Lagos City, in case you all do not know, um, this is one man. Before I came into Lagos, it's someone I've heard about. And when I came into Lagos, it's someone I monitor before actually joining you in Lag Radio. And of course, this young man actually gave me the platform that has put me where I am today. He's someone I am learning from. He's someone I'm still learning from. He's someone that we call him, or better still, he's known as the voice of Unilag Radio 103.1 FM. I'm telling you, I see him do his thing on stage five years non-stop. Every MC, every event was a total hit. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Lamu Lascata. The main reason why we are all here today, Lamu and, and friends. Thank you so much, Observ. It feels good to be here. Lamu and Friends, the first of its kind. I really want to appreciate everyone that has actually come to show me love today. It's and, truly, I mean, impressive. And yeah. but I never just to appreciate that. But now, uh, you, you, I'm sure you're about to go in any moment from now. Yeah. And of course, everybody is set and yeah. good. What is it about the brand Lamu? That's yeah, yeah. I mean, I started with University of Lagos 12 years ago as an undergraduate. And I'm extremely happy to be here today. You know, like made me what I am today. And I decided to celebrate 12 years in broadcasting, which I think is quite good. Wow, that's very good. Because yeah. if you come think of this, this is the first time I'm actually saying you're doing this. This okay. is the first one, right? Yeah, this is the first of its kind. You know, I'm part of those people that I used to yap him at his back that this boy, do, do show, do show. <laughs> I'm happy. And this is a good one, I yeah. must say. Thank you We so want much. to believe everybody's going to have fun tonight. Definitely. And we expect something from you. Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, to bring the artist on stage back to back. And um, I can assure everyone that um, it's going to be 100% awesome tonight. Are you also performing? Are you singing? Are you uh, rapping? I'll be rapping backstage. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Lagos CET, we give you the very best. We give you the very best. These are my colleagues. These are the people I am learning from. I'm telling you. Afolabi Ibikule, Olua Shemu, Oluda These are the people I have learned so much from. The Radio Duke and of course the real skills. You always have the argument that it's not the real skills. But of course I have both of them right here with the Red Carpet Lab One friends. I'll be asking them one or two questions. They are very, very intelligent people. So I'll ask them intelligent questions and see how brilliant they are. Real fast. What is the female name of a donkey? Well, uh, maybe I'll tell you that No, 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 later. no, no, don't do that. The world is watching you. Look into the camera. The world, what the world, is the female the world. name of a donkey. He's browsing it too. <laughs> <laughs> what is the female name of a donkey? The female name of a donkey. Well, there's no need to beat around the bush. Offside. Offside. <laughs> yes. All right, you try. Excuse, what are you doing? What are you doing? Respect yourself. This is a national TV. The national TV. You did. Oh, I, my baby. I, I can't ask you. I can't ask you the same um, um, question. question. Yeah. I can't ask you donkey, the same. Donkey. Eh, hey, your boy just boots. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, real skills. You schooled in Nigeria. Yeah, I did. I did. Your nursery, primary school, secondary school, Nigeria. All true. Can you help us recite the national anthem? Well, that's in this stress room, man. Like, I swear to God. You know, the show already started. National it, It's going to take a long time. National anthem. Lagos City again. Well, it's, it, it's love, love, love all the way. If you guys take note very well, you will understand that almost eventually all on-air personalities of you like FM 103.1 FM I've actually come here today to show love to a friend to a colleague to someone who is hard working in that same line I have someone I've seen do his thing someone who has so many energy someone from the coast to the coast the most Jesus he's the only one that have that line and it drops it the way it is natural Lagos City University of First Choice, everybody watching us in town, my friends, families, well wishers, I give you Agba, the real deal. Agba, what's happening? Yeah, nothing major. We are here to celebrate one of our own, as you can see, Lamu Laskata. All right, Lamu is a boy who has paid his dues um, in the entertainment world. Uh, the road was not smooth for him, but he kept on moving, he stayed strong, and he kept on pushing on. And today, here we are. All right. 
So it's a lesson and it's a food for thought for all. all right, no. but, uh, I must say, before I let you go, I'll let you do that line for us. Um, Agba, the real deal. This is the coast, the coast. Do that thing for us. All right. Uh, my name is Babatunde Agba, see, in case you don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, they call me Agba. My name is Agba, all right? Agba, the real deal. The man that makes you forget all about your old deals. All right? Indeed, that's what I do. You can also call me your host with the most from coast to coast, all the time and every time, taking you on a roller coaster. You can also call me the hyper, super duper man on radio. All right, ladies and gentlemen, guess what? Nigeria is where we belong. And it has to be a collective responsibility. Let's be law abiding citizens. And of course, uh, whatever we have to do, let's do it with moderation. Let's not blow it out of proportion. God bless you all. Thank you, man. One love, man. I knew it. I told you he's going to kill it. Yeah, Lagos City, as we said earlier, we'll give you the very best of its kind. Lagos, um, this is a friend, a brother, someone I've watched so much, and I wish I can just have small of his dreads. But Lagos, I give you the very best. Larry Foreman, world richest. Allow me to finish the line. No, 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 no. Continue, continue. Larry, where are you going to show? I'll soon do my show. But I, I don't think it's um, necessary anybody should be forced to do a show because every show are pretty much they are the same thing in Nigeria. So nobody wants to do something outside the norm. So you need to think and think and break out of the box to do something that everybody say this is a show. AY is a show. Okay. Lamo is a show. So. Okay, so so now let let's everyone ask this because there's a confusion going on around the country now. Are you a stand up comedian? No. Oh. I, I'm just someone that's funny. I'm not some stand up comedian. Okay, okay. Right, hey, now, it's okay. like you having an Adam Slander. Okay. As, a, as a comic actor, but not necessarily mean a stand-up comedian. So it's funny, right. actually. Okay, now um, I just want to ask you this because you're from my records. You finished with two one University of Lagos, right? Yes, sir. I finished with two one. Finished with two one. Yes, sir. Oh, man. Beautiful. Now, um, what do we call a female donkey? A female donkey. What do we call a female donkey? Don't cross. Is that is that it? Now you see, um, if you want to, you, it depends on the mood of the donkey. Okay. Okay. So the donkey sometimes takes different shape. Okay. It can be don't cross. Don't cross is the feminine version. Then there's the she feminine version, which is the don't cross. So. Okay. Okay. So so for you, is that don't cross or don't cross or don't cross or the don or the don if the donkey is very very big. Wow. Beats whatever donkey, whether Nigerian donkey or American. Donkey. And if now it's that uh, Nigeria donkey is dodo. -do. If it's a Nigerian donkey. Do do. Nigerian donkey is do do. -do. All right. Thank you. Thank Have fun.
for here tonight. Between your dad and your mom, who should you take care of regularly? Daddy or mommy? Mommy. mommy God bless you. Now, between your mommy and your daddy, who should you send the church card regularly? Mommy. mommy. God bless you. Now, between mommy and daddy, who should be the first to go to America? Mommy or daddy? Mommy. mommy. Wow, okay. Between mommy and daddy, who should go for medical checkup regularly? Why is everybody saying mommy? Okay now, between mommy and daddy, who should be the first to die? Oh my God. These women are wicked. You are wasting. Now listen, do you know that it is not everything your pastor says you should say amen to, that you say amen to? Do you agree with me? Do you agree with me? It is not everything your pastor says you should say amen to, that you say amen to. Now, when I'm on radio, I love to say this. Go and check your HIV and AIDS test. I have never done my test before in my life. I never do tests before. I never do tests before. But when I did with you, I know that some people say, go and do your test, but people don't you go and do your test. They don't want do your test. Now listen, last week Friday, I went for my HIV and AIDS test for the very first time. I know if one time my girlfriend say, are they going to HIV? I know say I clean, you understand? For me to remain like this since they gave that to me, you understand? So many girls in Uniland trying to get my attention, but I'm not ready for that. I'm waiting for marriage. What is you? Are you a living witness? Are you a married woman? Now listen, I went for my HIV test on Friday. I didn't know the generator in that place was bad. After they took my blood, they said the generator was faulty, and I should come back on Monday. That they don't open on Saturday. Oh my God. On Saturday, I was not myself. On Sunday, I was not myself. Monday morning, on Sunday, is a judgment. Sunday, I was in church. And then my pastor was leading prayer points. My pastor was saying, Brethren, you need to pray. I then we did research of God. He said, Brethren, you need to pray. Everything you are expecting next week shall be positive. Yeah. I had to attack my pastor. I said, Pastor, I know man should be negative. He said, Brother Lamo, what is the problem? I said, I went for my HIV and it said in that case, your shall be negative. Right? So it's not everything your pastor says you should say back to that you say. Bye, Chinese girls. They said that I am behaving like a guy. That after two your children, I'm still doing like this. Go here, go here, show us Jeleke. Come here, come here, give us any sexy movements. If it's not like this, then before removing the wing. So, we are contestant number two. Ladies and gentlemen, for the Lamu Show 2017, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, we have the beautiful lady on my right and the wonderful.
Nigeria was shocked. I said, who knows the one for the office? Now make a talk to Swan DJ on Q, please. If you don't want CNN, I'll just say that when they package news, they sweet. From the soundtrack to the newscaster, play Get Smart, you go hear something like this. From the soundtrack to the newscaster, the way that they package the thing, they make you feel like say you do where the news they show it. Play Get Smart. Now when you watch CNN, you're gonna hear soundtrack like this. They go show map of America, map of Nigeria, the natural picture, the picture. Yeah. <laughs> 